Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve if your device manager is blinking or flickering on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So first thing we're going to go about is opening up the search menu. Type in settings. Best results should go back with settings. Go ahead and open that up. On the right side, scroll down and select About. And scroll down again. And then underneath Related Links, you want to select where it says Advanced System Settings. Select the Hardware tab. And then you want to select where it says Device Installation Settings. Now, I would switch this to no. It says your device might not work as expected. This means you would have to automatically update your device drivers. Now, the reason I would currently set this to no is just see if that resolves the problem temporarily. If you're noticing that that resolves the issue, then it means that we probably have a problematic driver that hopefully you can identify if it's a recent device you just installed. Then you can go about identifying it and just removing it or reinstalling the drivers for that particular device. Otherwise, you can keep it a yes here. But just for the purpose of this tutorial, I would set it to no for a few days and see if that resolves the problem in itself, in which case it would tell you that there's probably a bad driver in Device Manager and you have to go ahead and locate it. So that's certainly something I would take a look into there. And then you would select Save Changes, again, assuming you're having that issue. Something else we can try here as well, if we open up the search menu and type in CMD, Best match, should come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive the user account control prompt, select yes. And now into this elevated command line window, go ahead and type in SFC, followed by space, forward slash scan now. Scan now shall be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter on your keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run, so please be patient. Okay, so Windows Resource Protection found corrupt files and successfully repair them. So once you've received this message, you should close out of here. And you want to restart your computer. So hopefully at this point your issue should have been resolved. And as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. Do about as well help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.